Is there a map screen? No. No, not specifically. Uh, sort of wander around the edge and uh, see who else we have in town to talk to here. You see a weather-beaten farmer. Good day. Hello. What can I do for you? What's your name? I am called Curtis. Oh, what can you tell me about your village? Our village is small, but we support ourselves. Aside from the attacks by raiders and the occasional rad scorpion, we have no problems. Aradesh is a good leader. Oh, what are you doing? I'm a farmer. We irrigated the desert many years ago. Although the wasteland is harsh, it's possible to grow things with patience and time. I see. You seem to be doing pretty well. What can I do for you? Uh, what are you doing? Uh, let's see, we're doing pretty well. All right. Nothing more we can do there. Five seventy-five out of a thousand, so leveling is a little ways away. And it doesn't seem to be anybody in town who has anything worth buying. So. Let's head off uh, and see about this rad scorpion cave. And quick save. And talk to Seth. Take me to the rad scorpion caves. Are you sure you want me to give you directions to the Red Scorpion Caves? I can't go, but I can show you the way. Yes. Right, so here we are in the Red Scorpion Caves. There is a uh, dead Brahmin. I think I'm going to draw my weapon here. Let's just take a browse around. Now, there are a couple of these uh, bad boys right over here. So, let's start heading that way. ammo over there. That'll be handy. Comes. Ah, let me guess. Yep, reload. Okay, let's pop this sucker. Excellent. And now, just so that Ian doesn't shoot me in the back. Get, get a better shot. There we go. Splash one rad scorp. And that uh, tail will be handy later on. Let's go grab this ammunition. Head over to this other scorpion. Seen us yet? 50 50? Yeah, worth a shot. Ah, oh, curse you. Step up a little bit. 51%? Yeah, there we go. That's a little better. Be 
Beautiful. Each of those tails, um, Doc Razlo will turn into a, an antidote for us uh, when we go back to town. here that seem headed our direction. I think I'd rather head over to see about this one. Now, where did Ian get himself to? It's okay, we'll take one shot and try to back off a little bit. Head back in. Beautiful. Another 110 experience. Should be leveling actually pretty quick here. My character. Oh, yes. Yeah, perfect. Uh, next, next scorpion we drop should actually uh, gain us a level. Two at once won't be too challenging. Not bad. Okay, if Ian just had to reload, that means there's a good chance I'll have to. Oh, no, perfect. <laughs> I'm just going to end my turn there. Uh, no reason to run. He seems to have aggroed onto Ian. And Ian's finished him off. There's that level I'm talking about. Beautiful. So, uh, character-wise, let's see. Speech. Um... I want to get my science up a little bit here. Um, that'll give us a chance to uh, make a check later on. Speech, yes, definitely going to uh, put a few points into that. Um, small guns, let's... Uh, yeah, get that up a little further as well. There we go, looking good. Grab our tails. Carry on through. Oh, we've got one more scorpion here. It looks like we have a few, a uh, couple down here as well. Oh, goodness. Okay, so three for down here. Let's try to finish this one off nice and quick. A 62. Fantastic. Uh, Ian thought that he was going to go aggro uh, those fellows. <laughs> I don't think so. Okay, need you to hold some stuff for me. Take that knife and take all of these scorpion tails because they're heavy. Grab that one. Beautiful. Pop down here. Maybe if we come over this way, we can try to keep the aggro to like a single dude. Hopefully. Try to take all of these on at once. Hit, but just barely. Did a little better.
and finished him off. Beautiful. So let's try to get a little bit closer in here. Ends line of fire. Oh, hey. Didn't even need to. And we've got one last scorpion to take care of here. It's the first one that's actually managed to get a swing off on me, so... Um, I'm glad he missed. Uh, there we go. That's all of the Rad Scorpions. 500 XP uh, for stopping the Rad Scorpions. Puts us well on our way to the next level. Some... hidden stuff uh, in some of these uh, bone piles, so we'll just uh, do a quick check for loot and then head back to Shady Sands. Uh, check your corners in Fallout 1, uh, just because there could be some stuff hidden behind these walls. In the corners, Leslie. Nothing here. Here. Those bones aren't anything. Now what about over in this corner? This corner has kind of a, a cornerish look to it, if you know what I mean. Uh, doesn't seem like there's anything really over here either, though. Here, uh, just more bones. Nothing special. Nothing hidden behind the walls, it would seem. Bones. And of course, some pathing weirdness. I already got the ammunition down here. Anything over there? No. All right, I think we have successfully cleared this cave. Beautiful. Uh, so back to Shady Sands. Uh, let's go. Actually, let's go talk to Curtis. The reason I raised my science there. So that we can go talk to uh, talk to Curtis, uh, ask what he's doing. There we go. Uh, you have all of your fields planted right now. You could probably do better with crop rotation. Crop rotation? What's that? You can only plant some of your fields, allowing the others to get back some of the nutrients uh, that the plants used up. You let the other fields become fertile again uh, by just tilling up whatever grows there. Huh. Never thought of that. Makes sense, though. Good idea. Bam! There's another 500 experience for bringing agriculture to Shady Sands. I suppose I should actually switch back to uh, <laughs> being unarmed. Um, I'm glad they did not just straight up attack me for that. And there you go. We're already in spitting distance of level 3. So that's good news. Let's head back over here. Maybe talk to uh, Aradesh. See if there's anything um, more that he can say now that we've taken care of his scorpion problem for him. Ah, 
things are much more settled now. Raslo has been working on a cure for the rad scorpion poison, and with that, we should be able to fight what's left of them. Don't need to worry anymore, I destroyed the nest. You are truly a hero. Know that the people of Shady Sands are most grateful. Thanks. Can I ask you a few more questions, though? Certainly. What do you wish to know? Uh, those look like all the same stuff. Oh, Greetings. I should try bartering with him. What? Uh, nothing of any particular value. Well, let's not worry about it. Goodbye. So let's go head over here and talk to Raslo. Hey, I have a sample of rat scorpion poison. Can you do something with it? Let me see the sack. Yes, I can do something with this. Here, take this as a free sample. It seems to work well against rad scorpion stings, of course, but it shows much potential as a general antivenom and poison cure. And there's 250 experience points for helping to make the antidote. And again, I can just sort of keep giving him uh, these tails. Uh, it's late. Come back in the morning. Okay, no problem. No, not hurt. All right, so let's wait until morning and give him the rest of these uh, scorpion tails. Takes a little bit of time every time we uh, go through this. It's currently two in the afternoon here. Okay, we'll take our stuff back off of Ian. Now the way we do that is with uh, steel. Now you can steal off your companions without consequence. Uh, it's actually the only way that you can transfer stuff uh, back and forth. It's kind of a weird mechanic. I don't think it was really intended to be that way, but you can't um, barter stuff with them without having to pay them money. Last one turns into anti-venom. If nothing else, we can then um, sell the anti-venom later. Okay, and we That's no big deal. We still got 142 days left to find the water chip. Two more. All right, fantastic. So this is our anti-venom. Uh, we've got some bottle caps, uh, still good on ammunition, really good on ammunition. Um, we do have a lockpick kit, and we are ready to go. So from here, um, oh, a couple other things to check. Let's uh, look around a little bit more. What we got over here in this bookshelf? Oh, Scout Handbook. Perfect. Let's grab that. I believe that trains my outdoorsman skill. See if there are any other containers that we can loot. Got 
a bookshelf over here. Oh, another knife and another stim pack. What is that? Those are rocks. I am not taking rocks. <laughs> I think that fellow just said hi to me through the wall. Let's see if we've got any bookshelf in here. No container from the looks of it. No, we're good there. Out over where we picked up Ian. Oh, perfect. Got a bookshelf over here. With a whole lot of ammunition. Great. Um, I don't think I'll need the BBs, but it never hurts. Ammunition is ammunition, after all. Corners. Go down here. The bed from the looks of it. Um, oh, Ian. Very much in the way, pal. Okay, let's try waiting for a couple of minutes here, see if Ian gets out of the way. There we go. Thanks, buddy. Appreciate it. shelf over here in Raslo's as well. Let's go see if there's anything worthwhile in there. Please do not take my things. Gotcha. I can handle that. Check the other side of town here, see if there's uh, any other loops to get. Uh, we might swing back this way uh, when we get back from, uh, from Vault 15. Containers in here. I might find some stuff. No, nothing there. But over here. Got this bookshelf here. Oh, a rope and another survival guide. Fantastic. Okay, so our outdoorsman is 11. That book and just take a look. 19. Fantastic. Outdoorsman has some semi-intangible benefits. Uh, it has a lot to determine where we uh, start uh, combat when we are out in the wasteland, uh, like where on the map we are. Uh, nothing in that pot. Okay. Uh, as well as you know, just simple things like um, how bad the encounters are that we come up against. Uh, sort of has a beneficial uh, effect there. Not huge. Uh, I'm not actually going to put like any points into it or anything, but uh, it's not bad. See anything? Oh, a sledgehammer. Well, I don't really want that myself, but we can sell that later. All right, fantastic. Let's 
let's uh, just give that to Ian. Uh, 120. That'll be great. Um, there's not really anything to anybody who's willing to buy here, um, but I'm sure that uh, when the time comes to go hit uh, uh, Junk Town or the Hub, uh, that we'll want to have some trade goods with us. I think I found everything finding in here. Okay, that's fine. Oh wait, is there? Nope. Uh, character, no, and Pip-Boy. Status, Shady Sands, stop the Rad Scorpions. Looks like we're done. Okay, so. Back to the task at hand. Uh, let's continue on to Vault 15. Let's see if we can't find this water chip. And there we go, Vault 15. Perfect. And I think, uh, well, let's try the ladder here. Oh, that is not the best sign that I've seen. Uh, looks like the door has been torn off its hinges here. Seems uh, it might be it'd take quite excessive force for that to happen. A little bit concerned. Let's just uh, quickly turf these rats and get them out of the way. Ninety-five percent to hit, and he missed. show you two points. Holy crap. Come on, dude. Not very proud of you e either, Ian. There we go. That rat wasted entirely too much ammunition. Speaking of which, all right. Okay, and wait, why can't I hit you? All right, I'll shoot you. Eighty-nine. Five hit points. Definitely gonna need some more points and guns. says this is going to hurt you a lot and me not at all. 